Hey guys, Kirby here. Today's DIY is all about a rose water spray, or as I like to call it, rose water. <laughs> need a dozen fresh roses, distilled water, aloe vera gel, and a small spray bottle. The first step is to get a dozen long stem roses, wash them, and then you want to very carefully peel off the petals and put them into a pot. One easy tip, instead of having to pull off every individual petal from the rose, all you need to do is find the stem right at the base of the rose, tear it out, and then just break up the rest of the petals. Then take distilled water, and you want to pour it on top of these rose petals. You don't want to go overboard though, because if you put too much water, it can ruin the integrity of your rose water. Then push down your rose petals so that they are submerged into the water. Truth be told, you could end your DIY right now, because this is all you really need for rose water, but I like to add two to three tablespoons of aloe vera gel. Aloe vera is perfect for your skin because it's soothing, and it's a little bit moisturizing too. Then take a small bowl, place it on top of these rose petals. From here, take your lid to your pot and place it upside down. And what this is going to do is as the rose petals start to simmer and lose their color, it's going to create condensation and it'll give you the purest form of rose water right in this little bowl. Then you wanna cook it on top of a stove or a hot plate, whichever one you have for about 30 minutes or until all of the rose petals completely lose their color. Let it cool down. Then take the bowl from the pot, pour it into your measuring cup, and then funnel the rose water into a spray bottle. Rose water is great for traveling because it's anti-inflammatory, antiseptic, and most of all, refreshing. And there you have your very own rose water spray. I'm Kirby, and we'll see you next time on Pop Sugar Beauty.